Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the another video. And it's been three days that iOS 17.5 beta one is out. And I am using it since then. And definitely I'm testing different applications. I'm using it regularly as my main device. And I'm also testing different things on this. So I can talk about this in my video. So yes, it's been a three days that iOS 17.5 beta one is out. And in this video, I want to talk about the battery life. And I also want to talk about a Geekbench score. So I will talk about the battery stats of last three days. So you can have a better idea that how is the battery is performing of the iOS 17.5 beta one. But before that, I want to talk about the Geekbench score. So let's begin with a Geekbench score. So going into the Geekbench 6. So there are two different tests. I did, I ran a test when the version came out and I also ran the test uh, today. So both scores are quite different. So when the version came out, the test was quite different. The score was quite different. It was 2273 on a single core while multi-core was 5701. While talking about today, Today's score is quite different. So going over here and seeing the score of today, as you can see 2318 on a single core while 5734 on a multi core. Now this score is way better than last couple of versions. Honestly speaking, if you compare, as you can see 2318 on a single core, better than this, not better than this one point difference, but better than this, 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 as you can see again, 5734 better than this. Like again, this was uh, iOS 17.4.1 that was quite stable. Again, this is beta, so we cannot expect it to beat the stable version, but still it was way better than hey, this, 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 and this. So yes, even it is first beta of 50, uh, uh, iOS 17.5, still it's a good update. And I have no issue with the performance. Everything is working really fine. No issue with the bug. I haven't seen any bugs so far, but if you face any problem, if you face any bug, let me know in the comment section below. Now let's talk about the main thing that is going to be the battery life, going into the settings, going to the battery and let the battery starts load going to the last 10 days. And this is the first day when the iOS 17.5 beta one was launched. As you can see, I used my phone around 80% according to this graph and I got a screen on time of eight hours and 23 minutes, which is really good. So the application that I was using was Netflix, Instagram, YouTube, PUBG Mobile, COD Warzone, Messenger. Well, I did talk about PUBG Mobile and COD Warzone in my previous video that was a real world test of iOS 17.5 beta 1. If you haven't checked that video, go and check that video that is available on my channel. Now let's move to the another day that is that was yesterday. And as you can see, again, I used my phone around 75 to 80% and I got screen on time of eight hours and one minute. Again, I was using Instagram, YouTube, Snapchat, WhatsApp, Tap Map, App Store. Moving to the another day that is today. And as you can see, I used my phone around 80% again and screen on time is six hours and 10 minutes. Now this time screen on time is quite different. I mean, it's a huge difference of almost two hours. The main reason is I used Facebook this time. I used Facebook a lot this time, as you can see, and Facebook did consume a lot of my battery because I was uh, uh, playing uh, videos continuously. So that is one of the reason, but still a decent battery life. Overall, if we take out average, I can easily say that using my phone for the 80%, I can get around six to seven hours screen on time, which is really good. And yeah, I think I have 17.5 beta one will bring even more better changes and battery life. Well, what battery life you are getting? Let me know in the comment section below. Also in my community, I post a poll that do you guys want a video on a charging tips? So maybe that video is going to be the next one with that video is going to help you with the charging tips and will give you a lot of better battery life. So for more videos like this, make sure to subscribe. See you in my next video. Until that, take care. Peace out.